thank you for being a friend. Hey, come hey. on in. We're celebrating Miami today. We have our first soap from HCNC. It's a beautiful morning with the barber shop duet. Hi, I'm Marcus Klinger with Klinger Vocal Studio. And I'm Sarah Vincent with Sarah Vincent Virtual Pilates. But on Wednesdays and Saturdays, we are the Barbershop Duet. Hey, it's good to see you. We're glad you came. We're going to talk about a few things today with HCNC. Yes. We've mentioned this on a couple of our previous episodes, but this is one of my favorite towels. They make these. <laughs> it really is his They're favorite. They're five <laughs> bucks. It's not like a major investment, but it feels like, a, oh, these are nice towels. Mm -hmm. And we're going to talk about this on messages today, but they make a beautiful line of bar soaps. Yes. And they shared a few with us. We wanted to share one with you. So we're going to give one away today during messages. This is the Citrus Blast. Mm -hmm. oh. We had a great phone call with Pete. And it was so fun getting to know him. He's yeah. very knowledgeable about all the fragrances and things. And today's pick is one he actually chose. Yeah. So we have Miami Nights for you today. Oh, let's meet the soap. <laughs> So we headed over to the HCNC website to pick our first selection we were going to buy. And this is the this one we This is chose. it. Get ready to elevate your senses with Miami Nights. Indulge in a most excellent fragrance experience. We can't wait for you to experience the incredible scent of Versace Eros Flame uh, in our wash. latest creation. This fragrance is perfect for those hot summer days and Miami Nights where a captivating fragrance unfolds. So our production calendar is getting a little crowded, but we had to put this one now while it was still technically summer, summer yes. because of this description. Oh, we're so excited to try this. And Pete was super sweet and he threw in a splash. Oh yes, so, so that you we get could both experience today. this in two different forms. Let's open this giant box. <laughs> Right, okay. so this is our care package from HC and C. We've taken out a few towels and things, yeah, so but we promise we have not looked at the soap. We promise. Oh, I forgot the go. label. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's so shimmery. It is. Oh, oh, get the angle. There you oh, go. Oh, it's kind of like a hologram wow, thing. Wow. Yeah. On. Okay. And then I let's see it. for the splash. Oh, oh, it's beautiful. I know. I, it's not coming across my camera. If, if you can catch this, it's the parts of the label that are the lights. Yes. That exactly. light up in the lights. Oh, I love that. And That's then the cool. same thing here. So I'll see if I can get the Ah, oh, the aftershave angle. splash. I love it. Yes. Ooh, I'm excited. Even just I by the know. labels. Me too. Even Lainey's crying yes. over there to try some She wants some to of smell this. some too. <laughs> I know. We might have to shave her down. All right. So it's a four ounce soap, HCNC, and there's also Rich Man Shaving oh, in on this, this too. This might be a little collaboration. Yes. Let's see. Brought to you by Hendricks Classics and Rich, Rich Hansen okay. of Rich Man Shaving. I wonder if they did the scent. Or yeah, we'll have going? to give it a whole whiff yeah. and see. You ready to uh, see what our first impressions are? Excellent. Yeah, so we got two soaps from HCNC. We got Miami Nights and we got Italian mm -hmm. Plum. So, so I'll take the lead yes, on this. Yes, you one. you take the lead, and you I'm, can do the I'm lead excited. on Italian Plum. Oh, there's the ingredients underneath. Made in Nashville, Tennessee. Oh, such that might be our great. first one from Tennessee. That's kind yeah. Of cool. Oh my god. Okay, All let's right. see. Our first soap. It's fun because it's a nighttime summer. We've done a lot of ah, daytime. You're right. This so this says you nighttime know nighttime built into the title. Oh, oh check out the pour. Look at that pour. Isn't that beautiful? All right, here we go. First okay. impressions. Let's see. <laughs> this is the best part. Are you in Miami? Oh, wow. <laughs> uh, oh, this is lovely. Is it? Wow. Oh, I got a little whiff. Okay, you got it. You, I need some help. This is so good. <laughs> Oh, wow. Yes, it's everything I was expecting and way more, way more. Yeah, it's definitely more like the cologne side, but I like it. It's yeah. very refreshing. It is. Oh, I didn't think that it's an homage. Yeah. Let oh, me you're right. It. I think you're right. But even just for like oh, my first but, whiff. Yeah, I, I don't even perceive this as a cologne. I I'm smelling all the I definitely can see why it's Miami Nights, though. Like there is a tropical, yep. like close to the water vibe, you know? If you like tropical and slightly floral and fruity. It really does feel like a summer night, doesn't it? But it's got more, it's also got built in it, like a, something along the lines of like a cashmere. Yeah, yeah, Or I'm something with you. more like refined. It's not just like the crazy Miami stuff. It's also like something more regal. It's, it's, uh, yeah, Let's I was going to say a little classy. Right, so, yeah. For sure. 
but it's, it's, it's definitely like, cleaned oh. up. Like you're you're going <laughs> yeah. out for the night. This is oh for sure. Yeah. Oh, take another hit. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. This is on the ritzy side, the elegant it's, And it's side, colorful, though. It's not dark. Right. right. Does that make sense? Yeah. Maybe that's the Miami vibe, but like I see the bright lights and the color yeah. and like there's life going on. And I like that this is not grounded in reality. This is grounded in imagination. Mm-hmm. This takes you somewhere it's, whimsical. Right. It, well, but it's almost like you're getting ready for the night and you're going to go out dancing that's or something a, That's fun. a great way like, to describe Like you want to have a fun night when you smell this. This will prime the pump. Mm-hmm. If you are wanting to go out and have a good time, Just, this you know, like, will inform your body to yes. get ready. Mm-hmm, for sure, out dancing oh, or something. like I hear fun lovely. music. There's right. there's some there's some entertainment to get be had. your bowl. This oh, deserves yes. a nice lathering. All right, so okay. we're gonna use our purple towel here. From we had to use the purple brush because and the purple brush. There <laughs> tends to be a theme here going on. Um, Let me get you some little... soap. Yeah. Oh, I hate to ruin the pour. Looks like it's the so... surface of the moon. It's funny because there is a picture of the moon on the label. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe that's intentional. Is it oh, soccer? it's got a, no, it's got a nice bite to it. Okay, we're, like we're learning that, that that's right. a little different. Yeah, and, and coincidentally, we have our, our lovely lather bowl for stainless steel HC and C, which just became available in blue and green and a couple of other options. Go yeah, check super that out. Fun. We were very impressed because it's a little more spread out for some of the bowls that we had to lather mm. in so far. But uh, yes, we have liked this so far. And while my beloved does that, yes, you get I'm to read all. Pop this oh, open. yes. I do have to say, I like when the splash comes with that little thing on the outside. You just know it didn't explode. <laughs> right. A <laughs> little bit of the tape on the outside. Although. You're stuck. This is clearly beyond my intelligence level. <laughs> you want to take over lathering and all this? You're not allowed to wear this unless you're smart enough to open it. <laughs> okay. We're getting somewhere. Ooh. Ooh, this lather is very nice. It's, it's it? waking up quickly. Yes. So if you're a newbie like us, uh, always shake your aftershaves because right. sometimes the little goodies don't always mix when they've been sitting on the shelf for a couple of days. All right. Here we go. You ready? I'm going to see the aftershave. Okay. <laughs> wow. Wow. You know, uh, I have yet in all of our aftershave adventures to pick a favorite version. Oh, but like... The, I, even though I adore this, I might like this even a little bit better. Well, I'm glad he threw it in then, because shoot. See. Oh, fantastic. Let's see. Oh. Yeah, good thing you didn't put anything on today. You can indulge no, in this the rest a, of the day. No, it was a shooting day. I wasn't going to put anything on today. Oh, let me get a whiff here. It's different. It's it's a different Ooh, it's character. More water, like yeah. more yes, absolutely. Water, aquaticy. Yep. Something. And I'm a on the ocean. Warmer. Yes. A little warmer with the spices in the aftershave. This is a little zestier. Oh. If I could, I don't even know if that's the right word. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. You think? Here, smell this now. Like. Yes. Little... Oh, it comes together beautifully. They play together beautifully. Oh, and you know what I love. I love that I am not hit with flowers. That's no. not how this but is But you doing know there's sweet. something fresh outside. Yes, it's fresh. It's fresh and sweet, but I don't... And, and I feel like that'd be kind of the easy way out is mm-hmm. with Miami like is to tropical. start with flowers. But this chose the hard way. This does not start with flowers. This this starts with, yeah, plants and trees and, and wind and breeze. Yeah. I just need a little more water. Sorry. <laughs> But it's, it's oh, really coming together. She is together. our lather champion. If <laughs> anyone needs a little advice on the There's newbie little... side, she is learning how to do this. That's But we don't comment on lather. But look at this lather. Oh, it's just beautiful. I know. I didn't even wake it all up yet, I think. There's, yeah, there's, there's a, still some little bits. The brush bits definitely wants to steal it all. Yeah, love it. But it's it's very oh. bright. I, I feel like I would be having a fun evening just yes. smelling this. And you know, you know what I like about homages is that they're not going to have the scent notes jumping out at you. You know what I mean? Right. It's going to be something that is a cologne because it's a beautiful balance. Right. I was going to say very blended. So yeah, balance, blended. Yeah. It's right. It's almost like an artist that works in colors that just have a way of speaking to you. These artisans have a way of making sense that just makes sense. <laughs> Yeah, but it's just that. It's knowing that that blue and that red will come together to make that perfect purple. That's what I, this yeah. is. Well, and it's funny. I just was always 
uh, a little worried about cologne because it, would, it felt to me like it would always be too strong. But this is not. Like, no. it's very well blended. No. I think you and I are kind of used to the colognes our dads wore. Right. Or people that would just put too time. much, you know? Yeah. Like, or just they were, I don't know. It's classier. It's cleaner. It's it's fresh. Yeah. This is not, again, like a linebacker coming at you. No. This is opening a lovely hotel window in yes. Miami and letting those first few whiffs of the night come Yeah, in. and you can't smell this and not think you're going to have a fun night ahead. Right. What's making this sweet? It, I think there's there's some kind of a citrusy flower oh, combo. Maybe. Yeah. I don't know exactly what that is, but it's very tropical, but it's not like... It's not like a strawberry sweet. It's not. It's it's no. more citrusy. Like it's more of a the sweet's very mysterious because I don't sense it in flowers. I I sense it in other ways. I mean, it's there, but I can't pick it out, which I like because you wouldn't want it to be any sweeter. Right. right. Oh no, it's a perfect balance. And you know what? On the HCNC website, they have a great description of the scent. Oh, right. Notes. Yes. <laughs> We're gonna, I think this is like the top notes with mandarin orange. You said I citrus. Totally. <laughs> okay. She nailed but it. But it's a lighter. Mandarin orange is different. Right. It's a yeah. Sweeter. Think of an orange and then think of a mandarin. That orange. is different. Totally different, right? Um, black pepper. Uh -huh. ah. Invigorating lemon. Yeah. There. Yeah. Ooh, what is this? Shinoto? Shinoto? Sh Shinoto. I don't know. Mm -hmm. more things to learn this yeah, is great wow and and rosemary dance in the air creating a yeah. scent that's beyond compare Ooh, it wow. rhymes <laughs> I, yeah i get that and at, then as we keep going yes at the heart of this fragrance pepper geranium yep. ah interesting and rose but like the light geranium yeah, with the I darker rose you're not hit with the flowers that's why it says but at the they heart are the intertwined wonder hey that's oh, even the next word I not so. on purpose there you go <laughs> intertwined to create an experience that is simply divine yeah. as the scent settles the base notes arise vanilla and tonka bean unfold a sweet surprise oh, okay. they're rhyming that may be where i'm getting i am sweet. down with this rhyming that's action. where i'm getting the, oh, yes, by yeah. the way i don't know if that was <laughs> clearly on purpose but kids. <laughs> Texas cedar and sandalwood. I definitely get that now. Oh, Bring okay. a warmth and grace. Patchouli and oak moss add an embracing depth. Together, all these elements combine to create a complete masterpiece. From top to bottom, an untold journey unfolds in this unforgettable scent. Brought to you by Pete Hendricks of Hendricks Classics and Company and Rich Hansen of Rich Man Shaving. Gentlemen. Wonderful. Our hat is off. Mm -hmm. This is There is beautiful. nothing I would say to add or change at all. No, like, it's nice. Like, they blend so well. Yep. And you know what I love, too? I totally get Miami, yes. but zero stereotypes. I'm That's not a very good way to put it. I'm not smelling tobacco. I'm not smelling lime. No I'm smoky. not smelling mojito. I'm not smelling the typical Miami stuff. Very but true. But this is still Miami. This is awesome. It's the other things. It's the being there. It's the little things. It's the classier side, maybe? Yeah. yeah. Can I smell That's the, a good way the to say splash it. here? Absolutely. Would you like a little on oh, your sure. hands? Yes. Just give me a little. Give me okay, a dollar here. here. I'll spin your hands. Okay. You well, then I'll trade you. Put it you. where you like it. I'll trade you. Okay. What do you think I of the like, splash? I like being able to smell it. More it's nice these. on you. That's a nice scent. I get, I get does the lemon. Does it feminize it a little? It kind of does, because now on you, I'm, I'm getting the lemon at the top. Do you feel the lemon? Yes. And then, and, it, and then it opens the door, and the rest of it just kind of comes in and starts the party. It is such a sweeter citrus. Yeah. I know that's yes. hard to explain, but I really do like that blend. You know, some lemons can just have that beautiful sweetness to them already. And right. So, I mean, most lemons are like... The sour. <laughs> but some lemons already kind of yeah. start with like that. It's funny. At first, I would have never thought I could pull off wearing that kind of scent, but it right. does. Well, I think when scents, I think we're discovering that right. when scents have a wealth of scent notes, and there are a lot of things that your nose can grab onto, because right. I, you know, I, I thought I was being mean the other day when I said a soap was one color, but I was meaning to be really nice because it was like the perfect color, and they went hard with it. This is more like. What did we read here? A dozen or more scent notes. Right. So what I love about scents like this, where it is super layered, right. is that I have to take a few minutes to get to know it. And like I mentioned before, if you're wearing it, I'll catch on to the notes that are more feminine. If I'm wearing it, I yeah. feel like you'll catch on to the scents that are more masculine. Right. Because now smell this and then 
Do you do the little dance around? You know what? The I am just charmed by that mandarin orange. In so here, funny because yeah. you were not a fan of citrus to start not with. Not orange. I'm scared of orange. Right. But I, I think like Donald Duck Somehow. orange juice orange. Growing up with like that of like, you know, your mom right. throws just too much water it, in yeah. and there's not enough, quite enough sugar. But th- no, this is. It's this alive. Is it's much real. Different. Yeah. And and I get that mandarin sense. The quality of the fragrance you can tell. You know, like wherever it came from. Right. It's that's the direct source. Right. I think they're trying to like recreate. Like the energy or the vibe of what you'd be in those places. So they're not uh, pulling the exact tree you're standing next to and the exact sand from the beach. Gotcha. But they're trying to create that vibe and energy of being there. Right. So like being there, but with your own theme music. Right. Yeah. Uh, like I feel like I'm walking into a fancy restaurant yeah, that has a club in the back that has right. like some energy and things going on. Right. But I really thought I'd be kind of scared of any cologne kind of recreate, not recreation, but anything. And so far this last week, everything that we've smelled that we found out was from uh, a yeah. original cologne scent has really surprised me. Yeah. And you know, it's funny. I, I get a lot of the citrus in here now. And in a realer way, but it's balanced out by sort of the imaginative stuff in the cologne. Right. I feel like we just have to go deeper to find out. I guess. So I think in this, there's one thing that's very real, and the rest of it is very imaginative and whimsy. Mm-hmm. And I wonder if all colognes are like that. Like Right? Because uh, I, you know what's different is I can smell the quality of it somehow yeah but without being overpowered right because i get right. concerned of that like too much in your face like i can't yep. pick no, out the different smells this is like a this super one has whole hug and i really do love the label i feel like i'm there like i love that label i wish we could get the light to come I can across kind of better smell the purple even i can i know i literally like whatever the combo colors are like that's perfectly describes that smell to me yeah and and i love that can you smell the mandarin orange is very very real and then the rest of it is very very imaginative do you get it's, that too? It's okay. It's the mandarin orange dancing with the lemon. Yeah. But it's a fresh, like I just cracked like open that real. lemon but in then front the of you. The rest of it is all imaginative. And see, now that it's more dry on my stuff. skin, give this a whiff more because I get more of the flower stuff and woods For stuff. For sure. The flowers and woods are there now too. Yeah. Right? Yep. And I don't really get the fruit as much here. But from the poor, that's way yeah, more citrus. Yeah, this is where I get the orange and the citrus. And then this is like right in the middle. This Everybody's the middle. dancing. And then this is more the woods and the. Yes, absolutely. Even like a that, tiny. The word that they use, intertwined, I, is exactly yes. what this all like, is. And I get the pepper here. Yes, that is part of the woodsy for right. sure. And whatever the chinoto is that I'm putting in a little lower third right now, yeah. so that we know. And and again, hey, my sworn enemy patchouli ends up delighting me. Right, I would have no idea it's even in hiding this. in it's there. It's just a hint, and it's just. Brings it, keeps it all in one bouquet, but, you know? Yeah, and I'm so surprised that I didn't, I just assumed this would be much more masculine, manly, darker somehow. And it's not at all. Yeah. It's super summer fun. Like, I want to be on a resort in Miami now. Yeah. <laughs> it, it's funny, you know, we, uh, you get, there are different perceptions of Miami. You watch yeah. CSI Miami and you think totally. of like, mm-hmm. you know, cigar sweatshop kind right, of thing, behind which can yeah. even have their own amazing mm-hmm. sense, you know. But then you know, this is more like I have been picked up at the airport yes. in a limo mm-hmm. and I'm being taken to a little beach. Right, with some neon lights, a little fun. And but I not... get my little chair and my little book. And, and I, I have been to Miami, but it was all the touristy side. It was all like, you know, every hotel that lined the beach is very controlled. Right, yeah, yeah, it's yeah. it's a clearly creating that like escape energy. But we did go to like somewhat downtown away from the hotels. And it does remind me of like, you know, the heritage of some of the people that are there. That's like, right. Built in, but you know, in a com- not commercial way, but for the tourists. Right. So it's it is all dolled up yeah, and kind of right. like has that little selling point of the fancier things. Right. And you can tell. Yeah. I I really love that they didn't go with the stereotypical Miami sense. They built yep. something different. It doesn't have tobacco. It doesn't have mojito. It right. Right. The, the assumed things. I am getting that beautiful tropical night. Smell to this. No, it's and, undeniable. And right. It's with, there. With the cologne, it just becomes my soundtrack, and I'm ready to bring these notes into everybody else's music, you know? Totally. Oh, mm-hmm. it's beautiful. And I, I love Pete. 
that you can take me there, <laughs> standing at my shaving mirror, yep. in my towel, with my razor, and I can go to these Escape amazing to places. <laughs> right. And I think if you can fool your nose, the rest of it goes along with you. So this is just fun. I can't wait to parade this into our shave locker and find it a place yeah, of honor for I, that and label. And I'm digging the label fun for mm-hmm. sure. And thank you, HCNC, for throwing in the aftershave splash. That was a super yes, fun Yes, we are gift. thoroughly and, and enjoying this. And we will definitely this. put it to some good use. And, and you know what? We actually found out that Pete does a special thing. He makes more than one of these. He makes a bunch of them. And if you go over to his website, you can actually get, get your, your own. own. So head over to HendrixClassics.com to find this and a wide range of other products. Check out the bowls. Well, I've had my shave only in Miami. It was a great shave and the lather had a really cool hug to my face. That let me feel a little more fancy free with the razor as a super newbie. And I think I figured it out why later. This is not a tallow formula. It is not a vegan formula, but it doesn't use tallow. Its first three ingredients are three really luxurious butters. And I really felt that on my face and it had a nice sort of conditioned feel afterwards. And the scent sat beautifully and stayed with me for a while. So scent intensity, 3.5. Scent longevity, 3.5. 3.5. Hey, great work, Pete. Thanks, HCNC. I can't wait for our next one. Welcome to Messages. We have a soap from Pete at HCNC for citrus balm scent to give away to you today. Hey. Hey. All you have to do is go into our comments section on YouTube and type in HCNC for me, and you will be entered into our famous jar of names, and we will pull it on the show next week, and we will send you this awesome citrus blast bar of soap, courtesy of Pete and HCNC. HCNC. Well, clearly, we enjoyed our adventure to Miami tonight. Oh, I love this. This is such a different world than the world of colognes and scents when I left it 20 years ago. Things like this didn't exist. No, the quality, and it really does take you there. It's it's a totally different type of cologne these days. I'm glad we're being surprised. I'm so glad the audience is demanding of soaps like this. I'm so glad the artisans are having such an amazing time, and they're so good at making sense like this yes. so that I can go to Miami every time I So that around. means you better not forget your next appointment with the barbershop duet. Oh, because you'll smell better just watching this. 